Hey Rose, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just sending this email to my prof about this assignment for tomorrow and this paper. You, th you think this is okay? Sup, Mrs. Williams. What activities from the book should I do for tomorrow? Do they need to be typed for the paper next week? How many pages should it be? And I was thinking about writing about artificial sweeteners. Let me know what you think. Later. You put in a smiley face? Yeah, what's wrong with that? Um, I don't know. I think I think maybe we should look at this email a little bit. I don't I don't know if it's gonna if it's gonna fly with your teacher. I mean sub Mrs. Williams, what's wrong with that? Well, I think instead of sub Mrs. Williams, well she's your professor, right? So I think maybe you should start off and maybe say Professor Williams. Alright. I guess that's okay, but the rest is alright, like nothing needs to be changed. I don't know. I think maybe professors appreciate it when it's all spelled right. I don't know if she'll like all of this what W-U-T in the for tomorrow. Okay, I'll just change that. Okay. I think she'll like that a lot more. It's a lot easier to read, you know, she's kind of old. She's not up on the yeah. web. Yeah, she's pretty old. Okay, so what activities from the book should I do for tomorrow? Do they need to be typed for the paper next week? How many papers should it pages should it be? You do you know how many pages? are you my class? Do you know how many pages it should be? I think that a lot of this information we can probably find on Blackboard. Oh. Oh well here's my Blackboard. Um brief, generally two hundred, fifty to five hundred words. Great. So, I guess I don't need to do that. So I guess you don't really need to ask that question. Okay, so, and like, my class is at 920. I know it's like kind of late, but do you think she'll be able to answer this question? I don't think she'll be able to answer the one about the activities from the book you should do for tomorrow. I think that that's a little too late at night for you to get that information. I'll bet you can find that in your syllabus, though. Okay. So why don't so we take I'll, that out, too? I'll take that out. How many pages should it be? Okay, but I do want to ask her about my topic. Okay, so let's make that a capital I. There we go. Okay. I was thinking about writing about artificial sweeteners for my topic paper. Yeah, I think that's really good. Um, should I ask her if she wants to like, set up a meeting or something? Yeah, see what time she's available if you really um, want to talk to her about it. Can we meet sometime this week to discuss possible topics. Um, anything else? Uh, no, I think that's it. Um, but I think you should sign your name. Oh, okay. So I'll just, I'll just write thanks. Yeah, I think and that's good. Rose. Okay. Okay, so you think it's okay. Hi, Professor Williams. I was thinking about writing about artificial sweeteners for my topic paper. Can we meet sometime this week to discuss possible topics? Thanks, Rose. Good. It's always a good idea to look over your email before you send it and make sure that it, it looks good. Okay. Well, thanks for your help. You're welcome. Anytime.